So this is uh, day two sailing on Mona Hall? Yeah, absolutely fantastic, isn't it? We haven't actually had the sails up yet because there hasn't been any wind. Any wind? No, none whatsoever. So we've been doing the standard motoring thing, but yeah. it's actually really nice to be on board a boat again and yes. the sunsets and the sunrises have been absolutely spectacular. Yeah. Even if it's a little smelly here, isn't it? It's very smelly here because of yes. the volcano. Yes. Two days after we got married, Carla suggested we sell everything, buy a boat and set sail. A year later we did just that. In the Canaries we picked up our naked sailor, Dobby. This good morning. Is our yeah, good morning. It's, it's very like, early, isn't it? It's four o'clock in the morning. We are on the train station. We walked half an hour from home with two heavy bags. <laughs> Full of camera equipment and recording equipment. And we are off to Heathrow. <laughs> and where are we going? We're going to Italy, Sicily, Palermo. Hello. Our flight is to Palermo. And then we're going to rent a car for two hours to get to the marina where we're going to uh, collect the boat. Yep, and we're going sailing. So it's going to be all rather exciting. Okay, so we had a good flight. From, Keep left uh, to stay on E19. From London to Palermo. We? Yeah, we managed to get through filling out uh, five different forms. Continue on E90 for three quarters of a mile. In all sorts of different places in order to take the flight. We have just arrived to the marina in Porto Rosa. Uh, this is a huge marina. So Simon went to the reception to uh, look for where to go because we basically have three ways to go from here. We don't know exactly where to go. Having accepted the boat at the marina Porto Rosa, our journey would take us in a loop around the central five islands in the archipelago. Starting with Volcano, Lipari for a lunch stop, Panarea, Salina, Filicudi before returning by the way of Lipari to Sicily. The boat we had chosen for the week was a Bavaria 46 cruiser, a standard charter boat with four bedrooms and three heads. Got to know you before you Got to know you, got to love you. Just keep walking down to separate ways. I can show you escaping your pain now. You break down, your drain now. Your heart pounds, your lips move, your Not enough wind to sail um, as normal. <laughs> I think it's gonna, we're going to find a hard time to find wind to sail this week. It's about six, seven knots uh, for the whole week, uh, apart from Friday. So Friday we might be lucky and get uh, 15 to 20 knots of wind. But uh, it's lovely uh, to be out at sea again. Trying not to show you my emotions now.
The name of this bay is Porto di Levante, on the island of Volcano. In August this bay is absolutely crowded, but looks pretty good today. Just a few birds. I remember the last time we were here and we had to anchor on that side because there was no space in the middle at all. There is a little village in the middle of the island where you can go for shopping. The next morning we were up with the sunrise as the crews made their way to town for breakfast. We were lifting the anchor to see the volcano venting itself as it does all day, every day. We are just looking for a place to anchor on this uh, beautiful, beautiful bay, beautiful um, little village just behind me here. And you see the church up, the, up there. Beautiful. That's um, what the Med has to offer to you, is just uh, all this history which we couldn't find in the Caribbean. So I think now we understand better why people stay longer in the Med.
Lipari is the capital of the islands. Its two harbours are split by the monastery on the outcrop of rock. Lipari was known for its black volcanic glass, much treasured in Neolithic times. At this time of year, the day trippers are becoming less and it is all starting to get a little sleepy. <laughs>